This is a Meraki 33, MR33, and in this video, I'm going to show uh, how to program it. First, we need to open this case, and there is a hole here, and you need to pry on the bottom here to take the side out, and then remove, like so. Then there are four rubber feet here. You need a screwdriver, a very small, tiny bit to open it. And take out the rubber feet. After you take off the screws, you need to use plastic to pry it in and slide to the edge. Then you need to use a screwdriver to hold it, like so, and then this opens. You can see this is a very uh, uh, big metal here and this is act as a heating. So sometimes you will find it's hot and when I do the programming uh, of high 12 volt and it's full running, I somehow need a fan to, to cool it down. This is a, a, a big metal here. Okay. This is the, the board and this is the flash. This is the serial port. I'm going to hook up and show you uh, this board, this flash is running on the latest U-boot uh, and not able to pr put uh, the OpenWRT on it, it easily. And I'm going to make the connection. This is the serial port and it's a little bit shorter than the normal connector. So to make the serial point connection, I take off the uh, plastic here to make the proper connection. Otherwise, I'm not able to clip on it. This is the original MR33 boot. Uh, the U-boot is 27, 2017. And This is your link NAND and with the 360 clip, we're going to clip this one to the NAND flash here. And the orientation is this, this side, this side is pin one and this side is pin one. So it's just orange like this and quite clearly you can get it. And we already know the 90 milliamps from the 3.3 volt from the uh, Unique NAND is, is good enough. So let's find the USB cable. So let's connect here and the other side to the USB port. On the software here, and 
and we can detect flash. Now, very first thing to do on this Meraki is to back it up. So you need to do a read in Thai flash first. Actually, I will suggest you to read twice. Here I'm going to show how to program the OpenWRT on the MR33. Uh, Assume you have already have the backup and now to program the OpenWRT on it, you only need to program two sectors. One is U-boot, which you will revert back to the 2012 U-boot. And the second is the UBI. I already created the UBI for, uh, for you can download. First, we need to detect the flash, make sure the connection is good and which is okay. And we only need to program the U-boot and the UBI. So on the U-boot here, we can select the file which you can download from the website. Its work file is the U-boot here. And the second is the UBI you need to load in. So let's program the U-boot. and then the UBI. Okay, the program for UBI is succeeded. Now we can boot up and let's see if the OpenWRT is programmed properly. So the MR33 is finished boot up and let's see if we can get the uh, OpenWRT installed. And it looks like we do. And currently using this uh, 18.06, which is in the download. And if you want, you can upgrade whatever you want. So the available space is here and I'm not sure this is good or bad. But anyway, well, this is how I make the uh, OpenWRT on the MR33 with the very simple NAND programmer to program the U-boot and the UBI.